Hey guys, today we are going to talk about a card that has actually gone up in price. And I'm looking at the graph right now. At some point on January 8th, it used to be about $12 low, or actually $12.40 median. TCG median on this price was $12.40. This was the card that spiked. This card has over pretty much doubled. Right now the median is $23.50. And even up until pre-release, it was around $15.30 on January 13th, according to TCG Players Mids. And now TCG Player Mids is $23.50. Foil copies of this, just if a foil has a multiplier that is a lot have higher than you are used to, then that means people are expecting it to see play elsewhere, outside standard. Median is $76.99 for a foil Kozilox return. This is by far the outbreak card of the set. Uh, it's not very fancy. It's a instant speed sweeper. And typically you wouldn't be like, oh, this card's going to be great. This card's going to be mythic. Doesn't really feel that mythic to me, but hey, it is a very good card. It already has a home in modern. And very few cards you can say that without any, without like having played the card. You just know, hey, Tron is a slow deck. This deals with slow decks. And then you can play Aldrazi and, and board wipe because that's one of the ways it can beat you if their board is so much better than yours. But five damage wipes up pretty much every single card that you need to worry about. And it's not just creatures with flying or non flying. I really don't like those abilities because they miss sometimes creatures that are going to kill you. It's every creature. This card is bonkers insane. I love it. I think it's one of the best cards uh, printed recently. Definitely on par with uh, Gideon. Probably better for modern playability than Gideon. And the foil multiplier shows that. Uh, it's over three times the multiplier is. So this card started out at, even as early, even as late as January 13th. You could have got this card for under fifteen dollars. You could at the low it was fourteen dollars, but it started out at like about fourteen dollars, and now it is twenty three dollars and fifty cents TCG mids, twenty one dollars and ninety three cents TCG lows. Obviously, this is a breakout card of the set. I don't see its price tanking too much. I think it's always going to be about a twenty dollar card in my opinion. Uh, again, that depends on how much of this stuff is open, really. I feel like it will be far less than Battle for Gendercar. Love the card. I think it's actually worth... Um, if you're a Tron player, you gotta get a set of these like right now. Because I don't see... Uh, modern Season is coming. And I don't see the, a significant dip in this. All cards pretty much dip after their initial hype. Because there's more... You know, people are opening packs and actually have the card now. As opposed to like right now where they don't. Anyway, bye guys.